this is uh, the uh, Circuit Super Sport game that I played. I played this um, uh, a couple of weeks ago, and I could not finish the first race. <clears throat> and I'm going to show you guys uh, how I've been how I've been doing now. Um, this game is twenty dollars on steam and i did a review and i gotta tell you i don't know that it's worth 20 bucks uh there's a lot of stuff that's broken the online thing is completely broken uh, i couldn't even get it to work when i was trying to write my review and then i paid for this add-on which is the top gear uh stuff which is nice but um uh it's like another six or seven dollars and it's it's more like driving well one is um the uh, Stig Challenge is you race on the race course from the TV show, and you have to try to beat the Stig's times. But the other one, uh, this thing is like you're racing a car almost like through a skate park. Like you have to go on half pipes and ramps and all this stuff. It's kind of silly. Um, but uh, we're going to go on the Grand Prix. Uh, we'll just go on the first one here. Uh, I, like th I don't like these cars are fun. These cars are fun. Uh, but this is the the first level and uh uh if you remember like i said when i played this the other day uh oh i don't really like these um i'm gonna go up i'm gonna go up a level um these are fun uh amateur i like to be the orange car so i could see which car is me on the track um, this game, here's, so I know more about this game now than I knew when I streamed it the first time. So let me tell you a couple things. The first thing I'll tell you is this game is, looks cutesy, fun. It looks like micro machines. Um, okay. This is a qualifying track. So we have to race each track twice. Um, and so what we're doing is, is obviously racing for position. Oh, geez. There's a, I got a little excited, a little excited. That's all right. I just forgot what track I was on. Uh, I'm playing with the arrow keys, so it's literally uh, up, down, left, right. It's gas, brake, left and right. <clears throat> um, uh, now, this is a qualifying, so these cars aren't really there. It's just I'm racing against their times, right? Um, one thing I learned is when you go into the higher levels, like this, this is, this is two lap qualifying, so it's just going to take my best time and put me where I fit into the pole position. Um, uh, if you just hold down the gas the whole time, you won't finish the race. You will slide all over the place. If your tires get get on the grass and you accelerate like that, you'll spin out. You will not finish the race. Uh, if you spin out once or maybe sometimes twice, but oftentimes once, uh, you'll be in last place. I mean, it is a hard, hard, hard serious racing game it doesn't look like it it looks like a silly fun little racing game it is hard it is super hard all right so i got uh first place on the qualifying now we're going to go for the regular race which is that same track and it'll be uh five laps um now here's something else once you start the grand prix mode it consists of five tracks, and each track you gotta run twice, right? Qualifying rack, uh, qualifying round, and then the actual race, which is what I'm doing now. You cannot save your progress at any time. You have to run through all ten races to save your progress. So if you do four of the five uh, and stop, then uh, not only does it not save your progress, but you take a uh, a hit on your bonus the next time. All right, so we'll slide over there. I will tell you that my normal um, technique on racing games is to stay in second or third and kind of lead a, have a lead car out there that I can follow to see where the turns are coming. You can't do that in this game. Uh, you will just end up uh, you know, rubbing bumpers with these guys, and you'll take damage, and uh, they'll just leave you in the dust. Lap one. Oh, a little hot on that corner. Oh. Hang on there, buddy. Um, but if you can see my 
hands, my fingers when I'm doing this. I mean, it's not like up arrow left. It's like let, let off up, left, 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 down, gas, left, 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 left. I mean, you have to just feather these controls or you will be all oh, a little wide. Oh, don't catch me. Don't catch me, fellas. Get on that track. Now, notice uh, those uh, uh, burnt rubber tracks that are there. Those will give you more grip. So as the race goes on, if you stay on the normal line, you'll have more grip uh, in those. Uh, if you can stay, you know, stay in the right lane there. So it's really helpful on corners like that. You can take corners a little bit close. I'm telling you, this is a game that is won by fractions of a second. Uh, I mean, this is the easiest level and the first track. So that's the only reason why I'm, oh, there's a one and a half second penalty. When you cut the corners, you'll notice there's like a little uh, cone. If you cut inside that cone, it cuts your acceleration off for a second and a half. Uh, that, like that little cone right there. Now, I can tell you that my car is already not quite, I mean, it's not too bad. But look down there in the bottom left-hand corner. You'll see how much gas I have. You'll see what my tires look like. Um, now, on a uh, five-lap race, you do not have time to uh, uh, go into the pits. But on a 10-lap ten, ten race, your car only has enough gas for like six or seven laps. So you will definitely have to pit. Also, the more that you um, drift like I'm doing, <clears throat> the more your tires will go down. And then, I mean, when they get down to a certain point, it's just like driving on ice. Like, you can't control anything. But again, for those of you that were here, um, oh, two or three weeks ago, you'll remember I was not able to finish a race. <laughs> Last lap. Coming in hot. I forgot that this track has this little tricky loop right there. But you're always, I would say no matter how you are doing in this game, you're always one to two spin outs away from going from first to last place. Like they're always, they're always right behind you, man. Oh man, yeah. I'm losing control of my tires a little bit here. But we're gonna push through for this last there we go. Come on, Flak 405. Oh, that wasn't the last lap. This is the last lap, and now I'm on low fuel. Oh, no. This is a 10-lap race. Why didn't someone tell me in the chat? You probably did, but I can't look. I can't look at the chat. Now what's going to happen is I'm going to lose all acceleration here very soon. Things are going to go very badly for me. Let's see if I can make it to the pit. I think I can. It's also very difficult to look at your stats while you're racing. Oh, don't hit me, dude. Oh, man, I kind of missed my pit. Oh, come on. Let's not lose a race right here. That was terrible. I'm going to lose the whole race because of that. It does. It controls your speed or limits your speed, I should say, while you're in the pit. What am I at? Third place. Couple laps to go. Probably, I don't know, I might be able to make up a position. Oh, yeah, baby. It does have that little feedback when you get the high pitch, the beak. That means you pass somebody, and when you hear the bonk, that means someone passed you. Don't go in the pit. He's battling it out for a second. Where's first place? Come to me. Come to daddy. Where are you? Are my tires that bad? My tires. Is that you, first place? Haha. <laughs> well, that ain't gonna do me no good. Doesn't do any good to pass him if uh, he immediately hit a wall. Oh, 
No, there goes my acceleration. That was my chance. Second place, though. That's one out of five races. Oh, oh, wait a minute. This is the final lap. This is the final lap. Don't give up hope, everybody. Oh, give up hope. Okay, now, now you can give up hope. Come on, buddy. <laughs> There's no way I'm going to win if I keep... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, come on. Uh, ah, so close. Uh, uh, there are not uh, 404 other flags. That's uh, the area code. Okay, there's race number one. Now we're on to the second of five separate qualifying uh, tracks. Oh, I love this track. This is a cool track. Start off with a 90 uh, or a, a little hairpin thing here. You got, got kind of a this uh, little snake area. Now, again, this is a qualifying rack right here. You got a big arc here at the bottom. This is a good place to pass people. Uh, these cars, again, are not here. Remember, these are just their times. So this is a qualifying, so I'm just racing against their times. To see what position I'll start in. This is a very short track. First position, yes! <clears throat> All right. Um, so every there are um, I believe that there's 12 different racing circuits and they're and they're all different cars. So there's racing hatchbacks. There's little Fiats. There's these cars. There's monster trucks. All right, here we go. No more tucky tucky. Only racy racy. I got to get a little bit of a lead here at the beginning. They're so hard. Uh, to catch people once you're down. I mean, I'm I'm like, I'll pull ahead here on this straightaway. I think your car is kind of faster on the straightaways, but <clears throat> there's so it's it's only because they're so much better at cornering. Like they just follow the corners perfectly, and so far I do not. All right, so this is a quick. Oh, this is a, another ten lap race. So everybody has to pit. So I don't really think that it matters when you pit. Um, so I usually pit after five or six, uh, five or six laps. I'll try to do a little bit better uh, pit stop than I did last time. So again, I'm letting off the gas three or four seconds before coming in, slowing down, tapping a brake, left, right, tap, 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 tap. I mean, it is so, the controls are so um, just razor thin. I mean, to get through that corner, I hit the left arrow like 10 times. Oh, that was coming in too hot. Hit the brakes. That's all right. What are we on? Uh, one of the, the problem for me is you got to follow all that information. I got to know what lap I'm on. I got to know the other stuff. And there's no good time to take your, your eyes uh, off the race. You don't get penalized for driving through everyone's pit, so that's nice. So line it up, slam on the brakes. I watch the bottom. Fuel's what I care about. The tires, I can deal with the tires. Uh, I wish I hadn't have done that, but... All right. If you um, hold down the accelerator when your rear wheels are on the gas, you'll start to spin out immediately. Uh, you, you get punished for drifting off the track. 
So notice that I got to the corner first, but he passed me on the inside. They're just so much better at uh, following that line and knowing exactly the right speed to enter and exit every single turn. I'm in fifth? I'm in third? You got some explaining to do. Third, man. Little undercut there. Trade a little paint. Ah, eh, second again. Man, I really wanted to get uh I really wanted to get uh um some first places on here. Uh so where am I at? I'm in a hard second right now. But um I got some tricks. I've got some tricks up my sleeve. I've been um uh <clears throat> Pops has been working on my car. He's put some little things in my steering wheel. If I press letters, my car will jump. I will, uh, I can shred other people's tires. This is a really hard track. Uh, I can shred their uh, tires. I can go underwater um, uh, as long as uh, my uh, uh, nephew Spridal and his pet monkey Chim Chim don't hide out in the uh, trunk. I'm losing a little, I got a little excited there. Okay, I might have been thinking about the time I was Speed Racer. That might not be this game. Pole Position. Who remembers the Pole Position Saturday morning cartoon? Pole Position. Deo, Deo, Deo. I barely remember it. <laughs> I remember the song more than I remember the show. Did the pole position car in the in the cartoon did it talk? Was it like um like speed buggy? I don't remember if it talked. Pole position. Boom. First place, pole position again. Turbo Teen, yes, that was a good, um, I think I probably have the entire run of Turbo Teen <laughs> on the server somewhere. All right, it's one thing to win the qualifying wreck, to um, win the final race. I mean, basically you have to run 10 perfect laps, and that includes one perfect pit stop. And um, after these races, brake, tap, tap, brake, gas, tap, brake, left. <laughs> I mean, I'm just all over the keyboard. It is not, this game is not, it, it's so deceptive. Like I said, it looks like micro machines. It looks like you're playing with Hot Wheels. It's a cute little thing. And it is a diabolical little racing game. Oh. So one of the things I learned is um, you have enough gas to make it through usually about seven laps. I'm going to watch my gas. So when you pit, you don't need to get your gas back up to 100%, right? You only need to get it up a little bit so you can, you can kind of shave a little bit of time off of your pit stop. Like that corner right there, you can't make it. If you if you hold down the gas, you won't make it. Also, your your um, your your natural my natural instinct is to hold down 
hold, like hit the brake and still have the gas down. And when you do that, it just eats your tires. You can watch your tire percentage go down. A little damage on the side. What are we on? Oh, we're on lap three. This will be four. Okay, so I look real quick at the gas, and I'm at 60%, and I'm at four laps. I might be able to actually make it 10 laps without getting gas. I don't know, though. Oh, two. I cut that corner over too tight. It's okay. I'm a little bit ahead. If I do pit, I'm just going to pit like a real partial fast pit, but I'm not going to do it till uh, six or seven, maybe eight. I don't know. Okay, so this is lap. This will be five. And my guess is at 46. So I'm not going to make it. Oh, geez. Okay, now that's, that's it. Look, I did one spin out. Oh, God, they're, they're right there. Like there is just very little room for error in this game. See that guy's right on my tail? This track, this track is a little squiggly wiggly. Okay, we're gonna pit. Should I pit? Oh, not for long. That's how much you get, guys. Oh. All right. We'll see if that's enough to get me to the end. Oh, no. Don't do that. If you uh, watched the stream a couple of weeks ago when I did this, you remember my car was constantly smoking and I was going very slow, and that was because I was trading. I was hitting the other cars so much, and your damage just goes up. And, uh, and that's, that's how it affects you is it, it damages your engine and, uh, uh, and then you, you have to pit, but, but the problem is once the damage is done, it's too late because you'll be halfway across halfway on the other side of the track. And then your speed just drops to like five miles an hour and you have to limp all the way around to the pit. And, uh, by the, you've lost the race. If that happens, it's already, it's, it's out of control. Oh. Get on that track, you dumb dumb. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Now I got one on my tail. All right, what is this, eight? Okay, this will be eight. Oh, that's always a... Uh, Good on the old paint job. God bless America. Get on the track, you dumb dumb. Hey, dumb dumb. Would you like some gum gum? <laughs> I say that to our cats at least five times a day. <laughs> I call all the cats dumb dumb. Hey, dumb dumb. You want some gum gum? All right, what are we... Okay, this is going to be nine. What are we on gas? Oh, no. Low fuel. No, no. It is a tragedy. Oh, now you're going to watch me go from first to last place. Oh. Uh, my goodness gracious. Ow. What I really, what this game really needs is a pit guy. I need somebody else to sit over my shoulder and watch me play and be like, dude, you're about to run out of gas. <clears throat> Oh, no, that wasn't the last 
help. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Well, this is going to be tragic. Hear those people clapping? It's not going to be for me. You can't really block people either. Oh. This is the 10th lap. The 10th and final lap. I went from 1st to 5th because I did not manage my gasoline. Tragic. Tragic. Oh. Big loss. Oh. Yeah, this is... Um, I don't know. I'm not going to be able to get out of this hole. <clears throat> I don't think I'm going to get back. Uh, um, which track is this? All right. So, again, this is a, a, a two-lap qualifying race to set our time. Oh, I do know this one. Okay. All right. So, we got to remember there's a hairpin U-turn. And there's that. Okay. And again, remember on the qualifying races, those cars aren't really there. We're just racing their lap times. <clears throat> All right, so there's our final lap. We got to come in for that hard corner and then cut back. 45, 180, and then 180 the other way. Down, back. I have to remember that down and back. Pole position, Dale, Dale. Hey, Aaron, I see you in here. I see uh, Steve Burtz has joined the party. We started off uh, Texas foosballer. Hey, um. We started off, uh, tried to do the uh, Sega Saturn, and uh, there's something about the Sega Saturn core on the Mister and my capture card and OBS. Something between those three things uh, just did not work. So I probably need a, a solid reboot in here and maybe a little bit more testing. Um, all right, what we got to do is just build that little lead. Also, uh, earlier today, Oh, no. Uh, I finished uh, the latest episode of uh, Sprite Castle. And uh, once this stream is over, uh, literally 10 minutes after that, uh, there will be a new episode of Sprite Castle. I'm going to give you um, a hint. I'm going to give you a hint. Um... Just tap it in. Just tap it in. There's your hint of what the next uh, game will be on Sprite Castle. Feel free to guess amongst yourselves. All right. And we're not going to make the same dumb, dumb mistake I made last time. After lap five... We're going to pit. We're going to fix our car. We're going to put gas in it. We're going to put tires on it. It'll be like a new man. All right. Whenever I uh, pit, I will look at the chat and see if anybody guessed what game that I will be covering on Sprite Castle. Or I already did record on Sprite Castle. <sighs> too much gas, too much brake. Just tap it in. 
Just tap it in. Well, it looks like Amigo Aaron is on the right track. It is a golf game. Okay, this is the fifth lap. We'll swing that one. Now on this corner, we're going to swing wide. And look at that beauty. I don't know if... Oh, I guess the pins are lined up based on your position. All okay, right. Give me some gas. 70, 80, 90, 100. Close enough. Get out. And I'm still at first position. Oh, they're in trouble now. I got my orange car, my good shoes on. In trouble now. It's amazing how far graphics have come in games. I mean, that's like, like so stupidly obvious to say. But I mean, even just a little goofy racing game like this, like... I just can't believe how cool this game looks. Now, if I lap these guys, do I hit them or do I go through them? Don't matter. I'm so fast. I'm the flaming nacho, baby. I'm Chester Cheetah. This is lap eight. Nothing can stop me now. I'm invincible! Oh, boy. I'm off the track. <laughs> oh, time penalty. Lap nine. Oh, came in a little too hot on that one. It just takes uh, just an extra, one extra second on uh, holding down the accelerator. And then uh, then you're in a world of Hachi Machi. Then you're the Flaming Cheeto. You're not the Speedy Gonzalez, Chester Cheetah. Gosh, look how awesome that is. Tenth lap. 45% gas. Oh, time penalty. That's all right. Chester Cheetah don't care. The flaming Nacho will get you all. I'm the smooth beta of Velveeta. <laughs> God, I just made that up. You don't say. <laughs> That's what my wife would say. Hey, dum dum. Ooh, you want some gum gum? Oh. Uh, EA World Tour Golf. I don't believe that is on the Commodore 64. Buck Owens guessed them all, so that doesn't count. This is the world's best Saturn racing game. First place. Let's see what this does to me in the standings. Oh, I, I hit enter when I showed all the standings. Oh, I love the little, this is like a little calming. There's like a little farmhouse. There's a windmill. I don't remember how this track goes, though. Okay, hard left. We'll start there. Oh, I do remember how this goes. There's a left, there's a right, and then a hard left. Oh, no. Oh, things have gone bad. Now, the thing is, uh, it's going to take my best time of two laps, so we're not going to count that lap. We're going to count the next lap. All right, so now we know the track. We're going to do a hard left. Then we're going to jot left. Jot right. 180. Ooh, 
Another 180. That corner gets me because it feels like it's going to be another 180. And then it's not. Oh boy. Come on. Push through it. Come on, Master Cheese. Uh, this is uh, Circuit Superstars. It is on uh, Switch. I'm playing it on Steam, but it is available on the Switch. Uh, I will tell you, since uh, Bunker Owens got it, it was um, Leaderboard. Uh, leaderboard Golf by Access. That is the... Uh, the game that I covered. So as soon as uh, we're done, okay, here we go. Hard left. Oh, that guy's gonna edge me out. That's okay. Now this is hard because you gotta edge left, edge right, 180 all the way around. Stay in the pocket. Stay on the cheese. Come on, super cheese. Oh, took a little damage there. I don't think there's a track I've raced where you had to pit twice. So I think if you pit on after the fifth lap, you should always be okay. Now that might change in uh, later, later uh, circuits or whatever. Oh, that's also tricky, right? Because you, if you don't see those cones. All right, feather the accelerator. Tap 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 tap. Just tap it in. Tap it in. <laughs> My dad uh, can never remember Adam Sandler's name. And he always goes, you know, the guy that's in the stupid golf movie and, and the stupid high school movie and that other stupid movie. I go, Adam Sandler? He goes, yeah, that's him. <laughs> I have the um, Saturday Night Live book. It's like the behind the scenes of Saturday Night Live. It's a really, really uh, good and interesting book. And um, uh, it talks about the season where all the new guys came in. I mean, the, the new three. It's actually four guys. It was um, Chris Farley, uh, Adam Sandler, David Spade, <clears throat> and Chris Rock. And there's a lot of uh, stuff from uh, uh, Lauren Michaels, and he's like, I don't understand what they're doing. <laughs> he's talking about specifically about uh, uh, Adam Sandler and uh, Chris Farley, and he's like, he goes, one goes out and makes dumb noises, and the other's a fat guy who always takes his pants off. And people love it, and I don't understand it. But, you know, sometimes... Uh, uh, okay, is that lap five? Yes, that's lap five. Okay, not too fast. Next time, we're going to just stop and just do a little work on the old cheese wagon. Come around. Um, you know, when you're the uh, producer or whatever, sometimes it ain't about what you think's funny. It's about, you know, having the, uh, the wherewithal to put on TV what other people think is funny, you know? And that's what he did. He put those guys on. But uh, he's... Says you know, he literally could not stand their humor. Didn't understand it. Didn't understand why anybody would laugh at any of it. But a lot of people did. All right. 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Bye. Bye. Now, the only important thing I can't look at, am I still in first? Yes. Yes. Did I not get new tires? I think they might have put jelly rolls on my car instead of tires. Who needs them? Who needs tires? That's what I say. When I was in high school, I had a, um, I graduated high school in 91. My senior year, I drove a uh, 1979 Formula Firebird <clears throat> with a small block 400 in it. And a Holly 750 double pumper. That's what you were supposed to say. My dad had a uh, carburetor from a uh, old project, and we put it on the Firebird. 
And uh, I went through tires like it was nobody's business. I peeled out every time I started from a stop. <laughs> I peeled out of my own driveway. I peeled out when I parked. I peeled out when I left a parking spot. I peeled out at every stoplight. Uh, and I have a stack of tickets to prove it. Uh, but um, I, I, I was a... Uh, I, I had to foot the bill for all my car stuff. I had to pay for my own gas. I had to pay for my own insurance. I had to pay for my own tickets, which added up after a while. Uh, and I had to pay for my own tires. Uh, so it was kind of stupid that I was doing all that. Look at that. Look how fast I am. I'm amazing. You ever see cheese this fast? Normally cheese is like lava. It's like slow and drippy. Not this cheese car, baby. Not the Velveeta of Speeda. That's my new name. I'm the Velveeta of Speeda. Um, and so um, I remember one time I went down to uh, this Texaco gas station. <clears throat> and I was like, I think I got a flat. I don't know. And the guy looked at it. He goes, I can see the metal thread on your tires. Because I would just peel out all the time, you know. And you could literally see the metal thread. I was like, that's pretty awesome. Because then when I peel out, there'll be sparks. You know, he's like, no, that's not pretty awesome, you dip. And so, um, uh, anyway, I was like, well, I guess I need a tire. And he's like, well, I don't have the right size tire. And I said, I don't care. Just put one on there. And he's like, it's like, no, you gotta, you gotta put a <laughs> the right size tire on it. I said, well, it doesn't, doesn't matter to me. And so finally he said, um, how about I put, uh, I'll put two matching tires and it was like this used um, bin of like used tires and they were $10 each. So I paid $20 and got two tires <clears throat> put on the old firebird. The Velveeta of Speeda. Dresu says, who's the better actor, Chris Farley or John Candy? Um, who's the better actor? Uh, John Candy. Who's the better comedian, like on stand-up? Uh, I mean, that... <clears throat> oh, look who's at first place on the pedestal. I told you. I told you. Woo! First place. Oh, I got a new helmet design. What else do I get? Jaw helmet. That's fancy. Jealous, everyone? All right. So I feel a little bit vindicated. You know, um, I played this the other day. I couldn't even finish a race. Now, uh, on the easiest race, on the easiest level, I got first place. That's all I'm claiming. <clears throat> um, 